it's Friday the 3rd of July, I think. It is. It's Friday the 3rd of July. I've not been anywhere. And kids, what? The weather's rubbish again. Luckily it's not rain. It was supposed to rain, but it's not. Um, or it hasn't yet. Uh, I'm just on the way to the lockup because I've got a courier coming who's come to collect a chest of drawers I sold in end of February. Um, and the guy didn't want it until after lockdown, which I can't understand because he didn't have to come get it, his courier could have, but never mind, I've kept it there all this time. So, yeah. I've just dropped Emma off at B&M's. Um, I don't want to go shopping. So I'm driving about to try and find somewhere I can maybe get a little drone flight in or take you or something. Um, again, <laughs> sorry about this, but I don't think today is going to be very interesting because tonight I've been asked to deliver again for the Italians. So I'll be delivering Italian food tonight. Yeah, free food. Let's see what's down here. Huh? This is that uh, Arashin just behind B&M's. So while she's shopping, I'll have a wonder through here. out down by the river um, winds just picked up though so that's not good yeah oh, there's a lot of swans up there I'll pick them up on this, this camera I had to start shouting I think because of that wind uh, unless it drops I don't think I'll be getting the, the drone out unfortunately Looks like there's a bit of a footbridge along here. Let's have a look. I know that's A189 Spine Road over the top, which is where I've just drove up to get to Ashington. Um, looking at it there, going to the right takes you to Bedlam, and going to the left takes you to Ashington. Oh, well, there you go. It's the England Coast Path. Uh, two and a half miles that way to Newbiggin. And one and a half miles to come us this way. Well, I never, not even you, about this. What a cool looking path. Sorry about the wind. Oh, a couple of swans down there. Like I say, sorry about this wind, it's uh, getting strong. I'm actually walking. Well, you can see I'm walking another river. Don't tell you, I have to tell you that. Stupid. <laughs> Down there where the boat are is where I was the other day and done the time lapse. But yeah, there you go. Never knew this was here. This side's obviously higher than the other side, but look! That must be full of fish. How cool is that? No idea what this bit's about. Oh, it must be a stupid thing. Lock for boat, isn't it? Well, I never... I didn't even know there was a lock here. So obviously the water's higher up that side than what's in the lock. So they'll open and then they'll open. Once the boat gets either down or up. Never even knew this was here. Doesn't look like it gets used much. Because yeah, that bridge is part of a wheel look. So we're under, underneath the highway here, as you can see, the highway's up there, there's a gap in the middle which I didn't even know about. So it's actually two bridges. And there's 
past the footbridge with the weir in it. But I'll definitely, as you can hear the wind, um, but I'll definitely be back with the drone when it's not so windy and I'll fly down to those boats, I'll fly underneath the pylons here and I'll even fly underneath that bridge there. But I don't think it's a very good idea today, but it is only a little mini drone. Um, I'll end up crashing. I'm gonna head back up to the car now, but how wild is this? It's, I love this. Um, but anyhow, I'm gonna head back up to the car now, um, but I promise I will be back here with a drone. That's 100%, because I think we'll get some good footage flying around here, don't you think? back in the car got a bit of a sweat on <sighs> that was a long walk uphill um, so yeah going back to B&M's go wait outside for Emma to come out which could be a while B&M where you can literally buy everything from a bar of chocolate to a garden fence what I tell you about B&M um, I had to go in because Emma bought about 20 bottles of cider uh, just the little bottles different flavors and core of a ton of concrete. Seriously. stupid are we we got most of the way back home and then realized we'd left Tristan's car turn the fans off um, and realized we left Tristan's car back Oops, go on. start again we left Tristan's car back at the restaurant so because we had food we didn't want it to go hold, cold hold I can't speak um, and my belly filled tired um, so I'm going to go and get it because we've just had my food and now we're going to go all the way back to go and get the car. Good times. And just to fill you in on the picture in case you didn't realise, I started work tonight in Tristan's car because Emma, Emma was busy and then Emma came across with the other car and we finished the night doing the deliveries in the bigger car. That's why we had two cars at work. We're back home, I'm tired, I'm going to bed, see you tomorrow, now it's time to do your job. <laughs> 